Squarespace one page website tutorial. Hello guys, Ilya here and in this video I'm going to show you how can we easily use this platform to create our one page websites. They provide us the opportunity to use a lot of different templates. So let's get started. We just simply need to click on get started on their main page. Basically, here we are on squarespace.com and after a small registration, if you are new to this platform, you'll come to this page where we can easily find all the templates we can use. Of course, we can try to create it from scratch, but as for me, uh, it's much easier to use an existing template and after that customize every single part we need. So they provide us the opportunity to find a lot of different templates and here we can even filter them through different topics, types and so on. So we have this category called one page website and um, as you can see uh, we can find a lot of different templates we can use uh, a lot of them are free but some of them are paid so in order to find uh, some additional information about this uh, template we can easily hover our um, hover our mouse and then just simply click on preview and here we can find how will it look like we can easily scroll down to find some additional stuff switch between different devices and as for me let's say that we want to create one page website about um, celebrating some party or some maybe birthday or something like this so here we are I'm going to use this stuff and let's click on start with this design and in a few seconds our website will be automatically created and all we need to do is just simply set up our title let it be like birthday party let's click on continue next next and get started and here we are on our dashboard from this page here we can easily interact with all stuff related with um, like managing this website in the left side we have a couple of options website where you can find all the pages basically it's one page website so these um, like option is not relevant as for us but sometimes you can add like about page or maybe like contact page or something like this on the commerce area it's like more about uh, dropshipping stuff so if you want to add like your products I suggest you to watch my tutorial about dropshipping on Squarespace uh, and in order to manage our website like as a designer uh, we have two options we can easily edit like um, sections separately but what I suggest you to do is that click on this icon with a brush uh, which means like side styles and from this page here we can easily interact with uh, st side styles like general stuff fonts colors animations and i also suggest to change our uh, fonts as for me we they have a lot of different uh, font group for example this one is pretty cool and i would like to use this one i always use only this font group on a squarespace of course we can set up every like font um, directly if you want to change it for this text for that text um, you can easily do it from yourself and also I um, recommend you to change color palette because sometimes um, you like prefer this color palette or this one or you can change every single coral color just simply switching from them right up here and as you can see sometimes it could be also really good and really suitable in my case I think I want to use um, this one here let's go back and now we are ready to also change some animations for example for um, buttons text and so on when uh, the customer or the visitor will open our website so let's close it and then just simply click on save and in a few seconds our changes will be automatically saved we can also change spacing is like margin stuff as you can see we can try to experiment with this I'm going to use this thing here so let's click on ok side styles close and now we are ready to interact with a wall design in order to do it we just simply need to click on edit button here on the workspace and we'll come to our editor we'll come to our design tool in the top of the screen we can find like the uh, current page and also we can find all the elements here if we we'll hover on them we can see that we can interact with this text directly we can move it we can interact with this button move it here or here and also when we hover we can change a size we can find some additional options we can do and the same stuff with every single element for example for this text here we can easily uh, change the what's inside for example change with me 
uh, we can uh, highlight it we can make it bold italic um, change uh, some for example like at the background or also we can change the what style it will be in heading or paragraph or monospace and some other stuff the same thing here sometimes you will be able even to change colors from the color palette maybe this one is pretty pretty interesting if you'll uh, try to interact with a wall section we can see that we all the website uh, is divided into different sections this header here we can easily change for example our uh, site uh, name let's try to add it for example helper months of day party let it be like this uh, we can interact with different properties add our links instagram and uh, so on so it depends on your choice we can also add a different sections if you'll click on this button we can find that they provide us the opportunity uh, to use different templates um, intro contact about people product services portfolios testimonials events quotes digital products scheduling donations images videos menus there are a lot huge amount of different options we can use with a squarespace in my case all i need to do to make it for me is just simply say, uh, change this text here this image here this text here this image here and the same stuff on the whole website and uh, we can also like add some additional sections for example maybe who will be on the party let's be like a um, people page for example this one here uh, and will easy you can easily like interact all you need to do is just simply click on edit section um, for example like not edit edit content uh, content and then just simply change uh, images and the description for every single guy inside when everything is done we can just simply click on save and after that uh, we can now go to click on exit and our website is ready to be published but firstly we need to explore we need to open like a subscribe page of course a squarespace provides us the opportunity to use it for free but uh, basically it's necessary to buy paid a subscription because we have like on the trial period and they have like uh, for one page website uh, two options personal or business um, plan and i think that the most suitable for one page website is a personal as you can see they have like free custom domain ssl security unlimited bandwidth video hosting contributors mobile optimized websites and so on so it's enough to create a one page website on a squarespace if you want to make it like as a drop shipping website you need of course to use commerce uh, plan or maybe business so yeah this is the way of how to build one page website on squarespace hope this video helped you out leave a like subscribe goodbye